At Southern Company in Research and Development Organization, we firmly believe that nuclear is gonna be part of the net zero future. So we started with a whiteboard, nothing on it. And we developed just kind of our thoughts of what characteristics a technology would have to have to really change the marketplace and bring value to the company and to our customers. And what we found as we looked through the technologies that were out there, the molten chloride fast reactor concept with TerraPower had tremendous value. TerraPower is a nuclear innovation company founded by Bill Gates. And like Southern Company, TerraPower has the strong belief that advanced nuclear energy is going to be needed in the next century. The MCFR, or molten chloride fast reactor, is a liquid-fueled reactor that operates in what we call the fast spectrum. And so there's some really different things about this reactor. It's operating with higher energy neutrons, and it's operating with a liquid fuel. In our R&D programs at Southern, we have a really core philosophy that is it's important to learn by doing. And in that learning by doing, what we try to do is represent the key parts and pieces of a plant as early as possible in the development cycle so that we can get a full understanding of what it will mean to operate and maintain a plant like this. The integrated effects test, which is sitting here and becoming a reality, uh, we've, been, we've been working on the concept for about five years now. It, it is a large molten salt machine. It's not an actual reactor. It doesn't even use uranium, but it will teach us a lot of the lessons we need to learn. The main purpose of this machine is, is to actually test um, what we call the thermal hydraulics. So it's like the temperature and the flow and how it responds. And we have a real world test and we're gonna take the data from that real world test and compare it to the scientific computational models as a way to validate that those models are, are accurate. The integrated effects test really is all about learning as much as we can, as quickly as we can, and as early in the development process as we can. If we're thinking about it in the context of a net zero economy, a net zero society, what are the problems we have to solve? What are the challenges we have to overcome to be able to meet the energy need in that future? So to me, it's things not only like decarbonizing the electric grid, but thinking about industrial customers, thinking about transportation, and what technologies fit really well with those challenges or those needs for the future. So the molten chloride fast reactor technology is unique in that it's very high temperature and a high energy density within the fuel. The fuel itself actually circulates through the reactor because it's a liquid, and so that can help nuclear get into decarbonizing areas that are otherwise very hard to decarbonize. The collaboration between TerraPower and Southern Company has really been amazing. We're so complementary in, in many ways. Uh, TerraPower is a nuclear innovation company. Southern is a solid, solid nuclear utility. Our teams have been working together with the Department of Energy under several key projects like the Advanced Reactor Concepts Award from DOE and the Advanced Reactor Demonstration Program. Nuclear energy is a technology that America created and we're now really fighting to keep our leadership in, in technology. When you're starting from a whiteboard and you have a big idea and you don't know the answer, you figure out pretty quickly that you need to bring other partners to the table with different expertise and different points of view. We knew that the national labs could bring value. We knew that we need a commercializer or a private entity to bring the technology to market. And we believe that Terra Power is that entity. We all have different points of view. It definitely takes a village to pull something like this off. We're at the beginning. I'm so excited to be at this first crucial step, and I'm looking forward to a bright future.